Good day everyone, I am Queenie Perbole and I'm here to do a recap in understanding discussion number 10. Sigmund Freud was an Australian urologist and the founder of psychoanalysis, a clinical method for evaluating and treating pathologies in, in the psych through dialogue between a patient and psychoanalyst. He was born, May, he was born on May 6, 1856 in the small town of Fire. Freiburg, Moravia, presently Prevor Zeskovlovakia, the eldest, the eldest from eight children. He also graduated as a top class and accepted to medical school at the age of 17. And, and in 1881, he established his own private clinic, specializing the, his own, specializing the treatment of nervous system and married to Martha Bernice in 1986 and have a six children and he died on September 23, 1939 at the age of 83. Sigmund Freud also proposed that personality was made up of three key elements, ID, ego, and the super ego of the mind. So according to Freud's psychoanalytic theory, the ID is a primitive an instinctual part of the mind that contains contains sexual and aggressive drives and hidden memories while the super ego operates as a moral conscience and the ego is a realistic part that me mediates between the de desire of the id and the super ego catesis and antichatesis catesis is a libido charge of energy means its direct energy toward an object that will satisfy a need. An antichatesis is the ego's restraint of, of the id's impulses. And there are three types of anxiety. Reality anxiety, neurotic anxiety, and moral anxiety. So reality anxiety is a fear of real world events that cause of this anxiety is usually easily identified for example a person might fear a dog bite when they are near a menacing dog neurotic anxiety is a term used to describe anxious and uncomfortable feeling that arise when a person does not feel in control of themselves or their circumstances and the last one is the moral anxiety it's based on a feeling that one's internet inter internalized values are about to be compromised and that will be thank you